Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shima and this is In Plain Sight to Rona. I'm back with another pick a card reading for you guys. And this time the pick a card reading is going to be about um, manifestations. Um, what are you trying to manifest and how close are you to your manifestations, right? So we're going to be looking into that. All right, so... Before we go any further, I would like to welcome in all of my new subscribers. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. You guys are amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you for supporting my channel. Also, if, of course, to all the existing subscribers, thank you for all the comments that you guys leave in the comment section. I read all of them. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, I truly, truly appreciate each and every one of you. For those of you who have been making donations, for those of you who have been... Um, you know emailing me checking up on me thank you thank you so much everyone i am truly truly grateful i um i'm feeling good now so yeah um let's get straight into the reading so before you choose your pals surround yourself in that beautiful iridescent white light if you don't know what that looks like it's up here on screen for you okay so surround yourself in that iridescent white light before you choose your pals Take a deep breath and then you can choose your pals um, according to your intuition. Do not overthink your intuition, okay? Well, choose which it with. Choose. I can't speak. Choose whichever one speaks to you, whispers to you, whichever one that you're drawn to, okay? Don't overthink your intuition. If you need to take a longer look at the pals, please pause the video. If not, we can get straight into pal number one. So pal number one, you chose Aura Light 23, this crystal right here. Let me channel a bit. Let's see what I can pick up. What are you guys trying to manifest? This looks like someone that's building something, okay? Building something towards the top. It looks like you guys are balancing out your chakras too, I'm seeing, okay? Your root chakra is um, starting to, you're starting to ground things, okay? You wanna ground things. Um, grounding, I'm hearing grounding. I'm seeing a white dove here, so white doves or doves or pigeons even. Um, doves, birds, could be significant here. Okay, that's a sign. If you see white doves or pigeons or white birds, grey birds, um, birds that coo, I'm hearing birds that coo, that do that coo sound. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, owls. Oh my god, I'm seeing an owl. Yeah, an owl. Okay, owls. Owls could be significant. Birds in specific. Every time I, I mention owls, I'm always uh, reminded of Hedwig, so yeah. Maybe you guys are waiting for some news to get accepted into a company, a job, a... Uh, I'm hearing travel, I'm hearing moving to another location or getting a job in another location you're grounding this i think you want you you you're you're quite close i'm seeing that you're quite close it looks like this owl here there's a there's i know you guys probably won't see it from there but i'm seeing an owl here and it's just about to land on this branch okay it has his wings out so it's, you're just about to land you're just about to 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 it's you've already taken off i'm hearing you've already taken off and you're about to land once you land yeah this there's something about flying somewhere or or moving to a different location because of a job Manifesting travel.
I'm hearing Aquarius for some reason. Oh, there you go, Aquarius. Okay, so <clears throat> clarity, focus, higher awareness. Containing 23 different mineral energies, Auralite 23 can promote undeniable clarity and razor-sharp intuition. An ancient stone, Auralite 23, is especially talented in assisting with past life and ancestral healing. It enhances metaphysical abilities, raising the bar on your innate superpowers. Most of all, Auralite 23 can help you appreciate the human experience and that we are all multidimensional beings by going within and becoming aware of your inner self you will be able to show up more fully as your authentic self and who you are meant to be all right so what i'm seeing here is that your ancestors are most definitely helping you with this manifestation okay um the manifestation of you moving to a different location getting a job in a different location or even um starting up a business in a different location there's something about you moving to a different location and starting up there you're meant to be building something in a different location you have flown okay you're about to fly and you are well you are soaring right now you're just about to land i'm seeing like like the owl just about to land on this branch okay so that's a bit of channeling there so you might have aquarius and pisces in your charts sun moon rising venus north node okay or anywhere in your charts all right prominently okay so let's see what you guys have these cards are going to indicate what you're trying what you are manifesting and how close you are and i'm going to see we also um we also have a uh, what's this Time indicators, okay? Also, I want to pull out some Scrabble tiles. I need to put this out here because if I don't see them, then I won't pull them out. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, my candle's out. I need my candle. Give me a sec, you guys. For some reason, I randomly pulled out a red candle. So some of you might be also manifesting love, passionate, um, new beginnings, passionate new beginnings, passion, passion, a passionate new love. Okay, so I'm going to be burning this red candle. Give me a second. So we have fan, <laughs> romance celebration party, okay? You have romance celebration party. We have fair man, dealings or relationship with a man with blonde, grey or white hair, okay? Bouquet, compliments from an admirer. And look at that, career, yes, career. And also ring, which is signifying marriage to me. This is a beautiful pal. This is what you got. you guys are manifesting. You're manifesting this... Fair man, someone who is going to come in, you're going to fall in love. This person you is celebratory, it's not just passionate love, it's celebratory. It's like when you meet up with this person, your energies, when your energies collide, I'm seeing sparks fly, I'm seeing sparks. This person is going to turn up with a bouquet of flowers. You guys are going to start a career together. And eventually, you guys are going to be marrying each other with ring. A marriage will take place, either romantic or business. Beautiful, you guys. This is what you're trying to manifest, okay? This doesn't necessarily have to be a fair man, but it could be someone who... You know someone who is fair someone who has equal give and take with you okay fair man someone who will treat you fairly blonde gray white light 
light brown hair, streaks, wavy hair. Again with the eyes, the deep eyes. <laughs> Okay. I swear to God, you guys, I do not um, look at these piles before the reading. I shuffle them out. It just amazes me the way they come out. It's beautiful. This person is going to fan you it's like they, they're going to fan your flames you know this person helps fan your flames fan your desire fan your passion um yeah could be an air sign because i'm seeing like that's air and then you might be a fire sign or you might have strong fire in your chart and this person is going to fan your fires and and stoke them You guys could end up, you know, I'm seeing like a candlelit dinner, I'm seeing bonfires, <laughs> yeah it's very celebratory, I'm hearing in the distance there's like horns and stuff, it could be like during a celebration. Okay. Great, okay, so <clears throat> we have balanced career in home life. We have go now. And we have find the blessing in your current situation. All right, so for you guys to get to your manifest manifestation, um, you are trying to balance your career in home life right now, okay? You're trying to balance this out for you to bring this in you need to focus on your career in home life focus on you and i'm hearing you're also trying to manifest to not procrastinate so much so it's like this go now is like okay i gotta do this now i gotta do this now you you're going to like follow your your when your intuition tells you to do this now that's when you you're gonna do it there's no more procrastination okay And for you guys to get to your manifestation, basically, all you need to do is find the blessing in the current, find your blessings in your current situation, which, me, which means wherever it is that you are, even though you this this has not come in yet, I'm hearing like look for the tiny tiny miracles every day around you in your present moment, and be grateful for that. Because this is most definitely coming in. Oh, by the way, you guys, um, I put the intention um, before I started this reading that um, I, I, I am trying to manifest this for you guys, okay? Helping you guys manifest this. Gorgeous. Okay, let's see. Five of Pentacles, okay? We have the Queen of Swords, right? Again, with that um, air sign energy and the Fool, okay? Aquarius again, Aquarius energy. Aquarius is showing up very, very, very prominently here, okay? So some of you might have strong and Sagittarius temperance at the bottom of the deck. You might be dealing with Sagittarius or you could be a Sagittarius. All right. So the signs I'm seeing is um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'm seeing Aquarius and Aries here, and also with Temperance, I'm seeing Sagittarius. Okay. So I'm seeing with balanced career and home life, you guys are going to manifest yourselves out of this Five of Pentacles, um, out of lack. 
This is where you are at now. And with go now, it's almost like this queen of swords and go now, you are, you are um, the boss of yourself. It's like basically you are the one who is telling yourself to, okay, go now, go do it now. Just go do it, right? There's no more procrastination. Things are moving faster. I'm hearing there's, there's like, uh, I'm seeing fast, quick moving energy with this go now for some reason. It's like your ancestors are pushing you to just go do it, go do it. You know, that's what I'm hearing. Because this is coming in for you and I can't wait to look at the time indicator because um, it looks like this is coming in quite close. Could be airy season, a new beginning. Find the pl blessing in your current situation. Look for new beginnings in every day. There's something new. Look for something new every day. That's what I'm hearing. When you come across something that you've never come across before, something new, learn something new every day. That's what I'm hearing too. Learn something new. Take that leap of faith. Anything that you feel like you have that slight fear or anxiety of just going after or, or, or doing something, you're going to be able to push yourself into just doing it. Just do it. <laughs> Nike. That could be a goddess that, that isn't, is it Nike a goddess? Yeah, Nike, Nike is a goddess. I gotta look that up, I can't look that up there. Cause I switched off the Wi-Fi there. Anyways, but I, I think Nike, I'm going to assume that Nike has to do some, has something to do with speed. It's like, just do it, just go, just do it. Go now. There's something about your ancestors pushing you to just do do something. Like if there's something that you need to do, just do it. Okay. And this is how you're going to find balance with temperance here. I'm seeing these two. There's there's some telepathy going on. Okay, with this fair man. Yeah, there's some telepathy going on. Anything else? Yeah, I'm seeing like this with this Queen of Swords. She has like this very um, intense stare, right? No, she doesn't have pupils there, but she has like this very intense stare. So she's very focused. It's almost like she's she's dead focused on something. All right. And with the bouquet, it's like falling under bouquet. Maybe this person is coming in with just one single rose. You might, you might, you might, you might. Yeah, there's something about roses or flowers here that you're going to be receiving. While you are focused on balancing your career in home life and getting out of this five of pentacles, you will be getting out of this five of pentacles, okay? Well, while you're balancing all of this, this is coming in for you. This is what you're trying to manifest. Pushing you to do all, the, it's, it's, it's small things. I'm hearing like small things to just start something with the, the fool here. And it's falling under career, full in career, find the blessing in your current situation. There is something that's about to take off while this lands. While this lands, this is going to take off too. Okay? All right, so <clears throat> how close are you? Friday. So this is going to happen on a Friday six the number six could be significant okay so six could be a date okay six the six of something Finali uh, finalize something just let go six could be june on a friday
Isn't that the sign of Venus or Mars? What is that? That's Mars, right? I think that's Mars. I always get mixed up between Venus and Mars. That's Venus. Venus, Taurus. Could be Taurus season. Taurus season to Gemini season. That's when your manifestations are going to come in. This is when this is going to come in. Okay? That's about a few months away from now. And it could happen on a Friday. Okay? Someone in this equation has to finalize something to let go. Could be this fair man here that has to finalize something. Okay. All right. Um, what else? Okay. So I'm going to pull out some letters. Let's put this here. some words see what else you guys are manifesting there's S O T L Z I E G M um, so we have E L O S T I T U Z, what is this? Z G T A M. Let's see. I'm seeing agnostic. Is that? Can we do that? Agnos. <laughs> Almost. So someone here could be an agnostic. Okay. Almost. I'm, I'm turning the Z into to an N. Okay. Um, I'm seeing mage mage magician mage magi magic okay um what else slot slot some some of you should go and play the slot machine i'm hearing slot machine Magistrate, I'm hearing magistrate for some reason. Okay, so some of you might be dealing with the law. Gist, that could mean something to someone. Um, for some reason, I'm seeing tomato. Tom could be a name, tomato. <laughs> tomato. Um, stew, stew could be a name. Um, guts. Someone's got to, um, you know, build up the guts to do something. I'm seeing Goetia. Isn't that the study of demons? Okay, so yeah, we can make Go Goetia. Must. So this person feels like he must. Oh yeah, there's something about go now. Must you must go now? Okay. Must. Lust. This person has a lot of lust for you. Okay. Lust. Um. What else? I'm seeing goat. Okay. So goat, Capricorn could be significant here, Capricorn, goat, sting. Okay, so some, um, for some reason I'm hearing sting. All right, so be careful. So 
that you guys don't get stung by a bee or someone here could have been recently stung by a bee. Okay, there's loot, loot, light. There's no H. Okay. I'm seeing sat, sat. So Saturday could be also significant. Okay. Um, what else? Satin. Satin could be something. Significant too. These are all just letters. Motel. Okay. We have motel. Something about a motel here. Something about. What else? Some of, someone here might like to watch Game of Thrones. Um, what was I seeing just now? Tame. Yeah, team. I was seeing slot game just now. So it's slot game. Yeah, there's something about slot game. Some of you guys need to go and try the slot game. You might get lucky there. Okay, glutton. I'm seeing glutton. Glutton. Someone might be dealing with someone who is gluttonous. Mist. I'm seeing mist. Time. Time. Divine timing. Twill. Someone might be wearing something with the the fabric, the twill fabric. I think that's what it's called, right? I don't know. Um, what else? Glutton. I saw that just now. Mutton. Mutton. Lamb. 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 Let's see if I can get some, some names. Okay, stale. Someone feels stale or, or stagnant. Okay, stale, stagnant. Something is still, um, feels stale or stagnant. So that's why your ancestors are asking you to just go now, okay? The Queen of Swords, do, do something like, it's, it's almost like slicing through this glutton stale energy gluttonous okay mute there's something about mute yeah mute all those negative thoughts stallion stallion uh, stallion could be significant lion leo okay um tate could be a name um Gate. Gate. I'm hearing Heaven's Gate for some reason. Um, meet. Someone wants to meet with you. Okay, this is your soulmate. Yeah, soulmate. Damn. I didn't see that. Soulmate. This is your soulmate that's coming in. Ting. <laughs> yeah, I'm hearing Ting. Um, with the the slot machine, maybe I don't know. I've never played a slot machine before, so it could it, it might it might it might give that off that sound like ting, right? It's like ding ding ding. Okay. Sting. Soulmate. Mountain could be a mountain could be significant yeah there's some obstacles here mountain we don't have n so i'm not going to take that uh, mount mount mouse 
okay? Some of you might be seeing mice or mouse or a mouse. A, a mouse. If you're seeing a mouse, okay? If you if you seen a mouse or if you catch a glimpse of a mouse, that means your manifestation is coming in very soon, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Um, glint, all right? Glint. I'm seeing sun glints. Glinting of the eyes. A glint in the eyes. Um, I'm seeing Molly. I'm seeing Tom. 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 Someone here could be a very. Um, adept. Like. Like. Um, a writer, okay, or really good at writing, alone, all right, this person is going, is, is alone right now, or you might be alone right now, or feeling alone, okay, you're not going to be alone for long, all right, Sutton, I'm hearing Sutton, that, that could be a, an area or a place, that could be confirmation for someone, Sutton, um, what else? Someone here might like to chew gum. There's something about gum. Yesterday I had a dream about having gum stuck in my mouth. Let me know if you guys have been having those type of dreams. I had a dream of having gum stuck in my mouth and I had to like pull the gum out. And, and it's a recurring dream that I've been having like quite a few times. But this was the only time that I was able to like literally take all the gum out of my mouth. Okay, so gum. Mm, what else? Moe. Someone might be, um, yeah, with this uh, celebration, romance celebration and party, you, you guys might be, you know, yeah, Moe and glass. I'm seeing glass. You might be, um, what? Celebrating with some champagne here. Lasting. Yeah, this is going to be lasting. All right. This is going to be something that's long lasting. I'm hearing. Okay. You're going to be ending up with someone. Well, yeah, of course, you're going to get, get married, right? Maybe you're, you're maybe you're getting married on a Friday, Venus. And I feel like the goddess of love is here to help also with your ancestors. So maybe you want to um, spend spend uh, spend some time with the goddess of love, all right? What else? Matt could be a name. Matt. Um, I'm seeing E L E Alec or Alex Alec. Stone. Stone. Yeah, some of you guys. Someone here might like to get high, light up and get high. <laughs> Why am I saying Guatemala? Gua... Am I... Is, is that... Guatemala... Almost. That's so cool. I need another two, uh, two A's to make Guatemala. So Guatemala could be a, a destination that you guys might be thinking of. Guatemala or someone might be from Guatemala Shin. station uh, station yes yeah, station okay so someone will be meeting at a station right station stationed somewhere someone might be stationed in Guatemala I don't know 
Gail. Someone might be called Gail. Gail. Um, someone teal. It could be a prominent color. I'm seeing teal. Um, any names? Lag. Late. Um, anyways so those are the letters you guys might see anything in there okay i know you can't see it from here but you guys get the get the point right <laughs> okay so eli eli could be a name Summon. Something about summon. Summons. <laughs> Sumo. Japan could be um, significant. Sumo. Uh, gel. Gel. You guys are gelled together. Why can't I see names? Any names? Tug. Tug. August. Yeah, August could be significant. August. Mel. Mel. Amy Yeah, I could go on for days and days with this. Anyways, Glenn, I'm seeing Glenn. Um let me know if you see any other things in the letters. So pile number one, that was your reading. Um, I hope you enjoyed the reading. I hope that reading resonated with you. This is what you're manifesting. This is what's coming in. Um, basically, this could be coming in in June. Um, Taurus, June. Taurus, June. Taurus or Gemini season, okay? Could be, could be coming in on a Friday. Um, Yeah, speak to your uh, the goddess Aphrodite, all right, or Venus to help you along with this. Okay. So I'm gonna end the reading there. Thank you so much for coming to my reading. I hope that reading resonated with you. If it didn't resonate with you, you can go ahead and choose another pal. If it didn't, if it did resonate with you, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and also hit that notification bell so that you guys get notified on future uploads. If you'd like to book a personal reading from me, you can find my email details down below in the description box. Email me there and I'll send you the rates. Um, Thank you so much for all the bookings, for all the donations, for all the likes, for all the uh, comments. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, everyone. I really, truly, truly appreciate each and every single one of you. And I will see you guys in my next video, okay? Bye. Hi, pal number two. Um, you guys chose Amethyst Phantom Quartz, okay? So let me channel a little bit before I get behind. I'm seeing someone might live in a cold um, climate or somewhere that it's still quite cold or it could be snowing where it is, where it is that you live, okay? Whoever chose this pile, there's like you guys have been going through the void a little bit. I'm seeing like there's like a line here, right? Yeah.
yeah you've been going in, in stages okay this is your manifest your manifestations are big someone here is trying to manifest something big here all right so right now I'm seeing like um, there's something about intuition there's something about intuition that is very very important in this um, pal your manifestation has something to do with you following your intuition absolutely there's something about this this purple here it's very it's very it's like your third eye is being open here your third eye is being open in this stage of um your life okay your third eye is being mm -hmm. um heightened and opened and and be polished i'm seeing polished okay being polished so that you can get to your manifestation so that you can follow your intuition and so, so that you can trust your intuition to get to your manifestations here okay there's a lot of meditation someone here has been meditating a lot all right i'm also seeing a family Someone here might want to manifest a family of their own. A family of four I'm hearing here. I'm seeing here one, two, three, four, yeah. Whoever chose this pile, you are manifesting a, 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 a family life. There's, there's a family here, I'm seeing a family, okay? A secure family um, life. And then there, with all this white, it's, it's, it's like you're going to be filling like this, this part with a lot of things. Your future is bright, I'm hearing. Bright future, okay? So let's see, what are you guys trying to manifest? Firecracker, excitement, all right, beautiful, okay. Casket someone going out of your life or the end of a situation all right we have bell announcement we have not unsuccessful plans and we have spear heartache over what you no longer have okay hmm. I feel like this is, maybe it should be this way. This excitement is at the end. Spear, someone leaving your life. Spear, unsuccessful plans, bell, firecracker. Some of you might have recently um, experienced a death in the family or a death Of someone close to you and I'm sorry if this has happened to you this has already happened okay so don't worry I'm not trying to manifest death here this has already happened this is something that, or that has already happened um, heart heartache you 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 have it could be a death of a relationship it could be a death of something okay you guys have been going through this and um, you have been grieving unsuccessful plans you have been grieving you have been taking the time out it looks like here with all this darkness here you've been you've been sitting in this darkness because you have been grieving over things that you no longer have and um you haven't been able to manifest much because you were in this state of grief okay releasing an attachment i'm hearing releasing an attachment to something an attachment to your grief too but something is going there there's an announcement or there is some news coming in with announcement and bell here okay someone here could be called bell Right, there's some, some sort of news that's coming in 
and it's going to give you a lot of excitement. There's going to be a lot of excitement. I'm hearing firecrackers. If you hear firecrackers or fireworks, if you see fireworks, that could be a confirmation of uh, your manifestation is coming in um, very soon. Okay. Bell announcement. I'm also hearing a lot of text messages like with the, the bell. A lot of texting. Yeah, the reason why you haven't been able, some of you have been having difficulty manifesting what you thought you wanted in the past. And you've been trying to get over this heartache and whatever unsuccessful plan that you had or whatever plan that was unsuccessful. I'm also hearing someone going through an ego death here. There's something, there's something within you that's dying, okay? Yeah. But with Bell announcement here, Bell, you're going to get a text message that is going to bring you in a lot of excitement this is something that's going to make you really 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 excited okay let's see let me put that there first we have drink more water okay we have choose peace nurture yourself all right <clears throat> okay so whoever chose this pal You guys are just trying to manifest yourself. You don't, I'm, I'm hearing that you don't, you're, you're not necessarily sure what to manifest anymore because, because of your unsuccessful plans and maybe you are having heartache and anger and, and you're going through the, the, the process of grieving, whatever this is. So you're not really focused on manifesting anything. You weren't, I, I don't know where you are on this timeline, but you weren't, focused on manifesting anything you felt like this wasn't going to happen but then you are going to receive a text message or you received or you've recently received a text message that has made you really 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 excited so right now with drink more water choose peace and nurture yourself you're being asked to take care of yourself first okay drink more water is basically just taking care of your health and you can't get any more clear than this drink more water with Oshun here Okay. Some of you might be might want to work with this goddess. And also Mother Mary, I'm hearing. Someone here could be called Mary. You just want peace. You're just trying to manifest peace within your life. Maybe within yourself. You want to manifest, I'm hearing you want to manifest yourself out of this pain of losing someone of losing a situation um, you want to manifest yourself out of heartache untie the knot or untie the attachment to this heartache and you are you this this message that's going to come in this text message i'm hearing specifically text message or email that's going to come in this is going to bring you in it's going to like blow out all of this immediately i'm hearing immediately yeah it's going to immediately just like all of this pain is just going to like vanish once you get this text message for some reason that's what i'm hearing okay but right now your guides and your angels are asking you to please nurture yourself, please take care of yourself, please drink more water and be at peace as much as you can. This is how you're going to manifest this text message in. What you're being focused on, if you don't know what you want to manifest at the moment or what you are trying to manifest or you're not sure of what to manifest, you're, you're just being asked to sit in peace, take care of yourself, do not over over extend yourself or over over stimulate i'm hearing over stimulate yourself okay you 
I think you need to drink more water to manifest something. Like literally drink more water. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally seeing, he, seeing, I'm seeing someone drink a lot of water, but I'm also hearing someone say, just ask this person to drink more water, drink more and more water. Maybe speak manifestations into your water, okay? Speak peace into your water, yes. Yeah, speak peace into your water so that you can nurture yourself. This is how you take care of yourself. This is this is just the, the beginning. If you can't even get up or if you don't, if you um, don't have the energy to get up and do things or, you know, be active or anything, it's okay. Your guys are saying it's okay. You are meant to rest. Just drink more water. I'm seeing this, this um, Mother Mary is putting her hands over her heart so maybe you want to meditate and put your hands over your heart um, chakra I feel like it's your heart chakra yes your heart chakra here that has a lot of pain stuck within okay so maybe you want to sit in meditation and put your hands over your heart and just sit in peace with your hands over your heart for as long as you can if you feel any emotions coming up for you you know like if you're meant to cry cry out that's why you're being asked to drink more water okay so that you can flush these feelings out there's something about flushing out these emotions these stuck emotions this heartache mm. I didn't read this okay wait I'm at this Phantom Quartz, expression, gifts, originality. Amethyst fan Phantom Quartz fosters prolific energy and opens the crown chakra to channel creativity in all its forms. Individuality is encouraged and uniqueness in expression is embraced by the stone. Amethyst Phantom Quartz instills confidence in your creations and urges you to share your talents. Maybe you are trying to, um, you're still figuring out what exactly you want to manifest or what exactly you want to do what exactly you want to put your heart and soul into right okay and um, you do have a talent there's a talent here that you have yeah using intuition as a powerful resource amethyst phantom quartz connects you with your spiritual team to convey your ideas in a way that will stand out do yourself a favor and show the world what you've got so you could be Vir you could have virgo capricorn aquarius pisces in your jupiter neptune sun moon rising venus north node okay anywhere all right do yourself a favor and show the world what you've got so i feel like Maybe you're trying to manifest something or a talent or you're, you're, you're building up on a talent. You're, you want to build up on a certain gift or talent of yours, okay? If you can work with amethyst or meditate, yeah, sit with amethyst over your heart chakra, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Look at this. She's also got like the star on her crown, right? She's got the star on her crown. I'm also hearing Aquarius again, okay? So, um, with the star on the crown, I feel like if you... Okay. <laughs> I need to take a breath. breath. I have so many thoughts running. I'm, I'm getting so many downloads, you guys. All right, so... When you sit like this in meditation, okay? Ask your guys to connect with you and ask your guys to come in and balance out your chakras, especially your crown. Okay, I'm hearing your crown and your heart, your heart chakra, all right? Ask your guys to come in and yeah, look at this. Look at all the, 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 the diamonds around her crown, right? Ideas, ideas, yes. Your, your guys are trying to, to give you ideas, but you're confused right now because you are so you haven't released something fully yet okay so you're being asked to drink more water okay and choose to sit in peace stay in peace okay just be at peace don't allow 
anxiety to creep up on you when you do feel anxiety creeping up on you just put your hands over your heart okay just tell yourself I'm okay tell yourself I'm okay and then go drink some water and speak love into the water okay so let's see I'm gonna use this deck here should I use this deck? the other one you're not getting the messages that's what I'm hearing you're you're not getting the messages that your 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 guides are trying to um, give you so we have two of Pentacles okay yeah, there's something about you um, worried about time or juggling time. Whoa, that just went all over the place. Death. You're going through it. Sorry, guys, I got cut off. Anyways, um, so we got death just now. We're seeing death, and we have three of ones. You guys are going through a death process okay you're, you're going through a rebirth process all right a part of you an old part of you is dying a, an old timeline is dying off that's why you feel this way and that's why you are being asked to you've been asked to grieve okay certain situations in your life has been um, divinely orchestrated for you to trigger you into grieving because you are going through a transformation process with death here all right been you've been confused about time you've been juggling time you feel like you don't have enough time or that time is not on your side or something you're just being asked to drink more water okay I don't know why I'm hearing your guides are saying drink more water speak love into your water try and be at, at peace it's it's almost like I'm hearing like it's, it's it's an ascension process I feel like this is something that I went through the past few weeks okay this is this is similar to something that I went through of the past few weeks all right grieving something that that is being taken out of your life or there's, you, you feel like you're being... Like something within you is dying. So while you're going through this death process here, your ships are going to be coming in, okay? You are going to find your talents. You are going to find your gifts, okay? All of these talents and gifts they come in after you're done with this death process that's why you're not you're not meant to 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 know what you're about to manifest it, it, it's 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 going to come to you after a text message comes through and it's going to bring in some really exciting news it's going to make you incredibly excited okay right now you're being asked to nurture yourself all right okay I'm gonna pull out some scrabble tiles and see if I can get some letters <clears throat> or words let's 
let's just leave that. We have D R N O I. We have I again, N F A F I E. Okay. So I'm seeing drone. Someone is just like drone. For some reason, I'm hearing like bored. All right. Finn could be a name or it could be a significant. Uh, what else? There's a lot of eyes here. I'm hearing dolphin for some reason. So dolphins could be significant. All right. I mean, yeah, darn, 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 right? Four, okay, so you could have been dealing with someone who um, was against you, someone who was working against you, okay? Ford, someone here might drive a Ford truck, I'm hearing, I don't know. Um, Someone here could be called Ian. Ian Fan. Fine. Fine. Everything's going to be fine, I'm hearing, okay? Things are going to be fine. Road. I'm hearing Rhode Island for some reason. Okay, so New York could be significant here. Is it New York, Rhode Island? I think it is. I'm going to assume it is. Why am I seeing Nefer Nefertiti? I'm hearing Nefertiti for some reason because that's what I'm seeing. Nefertiti. Um, Dion. 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 I'm hearing Dionysus. So that could be some, some, someone could be drinking a lot. Okay, with Dionysus here, I'm seeing someone could be drinking a lot. Maybe you want to um, uh, slow down on the alcohol and drink more water. I'm hearing, okay. Fire. Fire. Yeah, fire. Fire. Firecracker. Yeah, so, something is going to. to spark you up okay after this text message comes through it's going to spark you up i'm going to be looking at time um the time indicator for when this is coming in fire free i'm also hearing free okay you're going to be free of this all right friend you're going to yeah friend friend and foe. So some of you might have been dealing with someone who was a friend but they turned out to be a foe. They were working behind your back or they were working they were working against you, okay? I don't know why I'm hearing maybe um I don't know, you were fighting over a lover or something or someone someone got cheated on here. Fed Federal, federal. I mean federal. So someone here could be dealing with the law here. Okay. Rain. Yeah, you've been going through this cleansing period. Okay, this this. Or it could be raining where you are right now rain or cold or snowing that's what I was getting with the, the weather just now um, uh, someone here could be deaf or you yeah you're deaf you're deaf your 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 ear chakras your intuition you, you can't get the messages it's almost like you're deaf to the, the the messages that your guys are trying to tell you here 
Okay, trying to get through to you. Death. Friday could be yeah, Friday could be significant. You could be drawn to another pal um, because that Friday came out in another pal for some reason. So Friday Dan could be a name. Dan Danny um, Daniel Daniel. Fear. Someone here has been gripped by fear, okay? So maybe you have been um, dealing with some fears, okay? Dawn? I don't want to go there. Raid. Raid. Hmm. Raid. That could mean something to someone, not sure. No one. Can you get any names? Eddie. Eddie. Okay, um, ready. I'm hearing ready. Okay, get ready. This text message is going to come in. Ready? Read. Yeah. Don't leave it on read. I'm hearing, okay? Don't leave it on read. Don't leave this text message on read. Read. Anything else? Dean. Okay. Someone could be in college with Dean. Um, college could be significant here. Nord. Nord. I'm hearing Nord. The keyboard. Okay, so Nord. The keyboard. So someone here could be a musician with Nord. Or, or play the keyboard or the piano. Rhonda. Okay, so that could be a name, Rhonda. I'm seeing Rhonda. I don't know if Effie is a name. Effie could be a name. Rina. I'm also hearing reindeer for some reason, so Christmas could have been significant here. Deer. Okay, someone could call someone deer here, or it's you. You 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 lost something dear to you. I'm hearing. Okay. Also, okay, so I'm, I'm seeing um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, I'm seeing Scorpio, and I'm seeing Aries, Leo, Sagittarius with the three of wands here. So those signs could be significant to you. Uh, mm. Anyways, so those are the letters. That I'm seeing those could be initials those could be um, yeah initials to people places and things all right so I'm going to end the reading there pile number two um, please try and stay at peace okay drink more water nurture yourself all right you are going through a death process um, after you go through this death process this is when this this text message is coming in you are manifesting a text message that is going to bring you in a lot of excitement and is going to spark up um, uh, something new within you okay you might be drawn to another pile to see what you are going to be manifesting but maybe whoever is going through this at the moment you're being asked to be patient with yourself okay and nurture yourself all right your manifestations are coming in okay but you're going through a change here there's something about you that's changing you're leaving uh, uh, an old life behind I'm hearing, okay an old you all right so I'm going to end the reading there. Thank you so much for coming to my reading. I hope that reading resonated with you. If it didn't resonate with you, uh, you can go ahead and choose another pal. If it did resonate with you, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and also hit that notification bell so you guys get notified on future uploads. If you'd like to book a personal reading from me, you can find my email details down below in the description box. Email me there and I'll send you the rates. Um, 
thank you so much for all the bookings for all the donations for all the likes for all the comments thank you thank you thank you so much i appreciate each and every single one of you um and i will see you guys in my next video okay bye take care of yourself hi pal number three so you guys chose blue spinel i think this is blue spinel persistence fresh perspective and revival okay so let me see you guys you got two cards that came out when i was shuffling okay so this is also pyrite luck prosperity and success so you guys are trying to um this is a very lucky pal i'm being okay you guys are manifesting luck prosperity and success all right the goal okay i'm not gonna hold on <laughs> okay wait hold on I think some of you guys are trying to manifest in a relationship a very solid um, rock solid relationship I'm seeing here that's these two um, like pieces here right soulmates I think you're manifesting soulmates some some something stable something um rock solid i'm here okay and some of you are getting structured i'm hearing there's structure in your life i'm seeing a rubik's cube every time i see this i'm, I'm reminded of a rubik's cube so you're manifesting structure you're manifesting um order in your life i'm seeing okay um i'm also seeing some of you might be architects or designers or you might work with AutoCAD or you might work with uh, um, measurements, um, dimensions, I'm hearing, okay, dimensions, right? You might be designing something. Blue spinel. something solid you're designing something something um, putting things into place putting things into order things are falling into place And you're manifesting a soulmate that is really similar to you in so many ways and this is going to be a really rock solid relationship this is some some someone that you guys are going to feel absolutely safe with okay so what does it say here <clears throat> persistence fresh perspective revival okay revive to keep alive blue spinel brings new energy to stagnant parts of your life from inside your body to the world outside the name of this stone comes from the latin word for spine and blue spinel will give you a strong backbone sense of self and reason to stand tall despite any challenges you may face this is a great crystal for workaholics as it eases stress and anxiety and instills a renewed sense of resolution okay you can make it to the end if you put your mind to it blue spinel provides that fresh perspective to reset and reduce this is gemini in pluto so you might have gemini in pluto or you um you might have gemini in your sun moon rising venus okay north node too i'm hearing with pyrite leo mars okay so you might have leo in your mars placement too this gold standard when it comes to crystals pyrite attracts abundance wealth and prosperity known as fool's gold pyrite encourages you to follow your dreams and envision your desires manifesting powers are high when this crystal is at play pyrite has that spark literally pyrite can create fire when struck against another stone or metal and is believed to contain the element of fire in its core pyrite has acts 
What is that? Pyrite also acts as a powerful protector, shielding you from negativity and protecting the integrity of your aura. Strike fast and don't look back. Yeah, some of you are most definitely getting things into order and, and you, in the process, you are manifesting a lot of luck, a lot of prosperity, a lot of success for yourselves, okay? And um, you're being revived, I'm hearing, you're being revived. Your, your, your whole inner being is being revived and you're going to find um, inspiration to go after something. There's something that you're, you're manifesting the inspiration to start something and start something with passion, I'm hearing, okay? There's something that's being revived here and you're going to be working hard at it. Well, not working hard, but you're going to be diligent at it. This is, this. there's something that you will be focused on, will be dedicated to, okay? A devoted relationship too, I'm hearing, okay? A dedicated relationship. You're going to devote your time to a relationship. You're going to devote your time to a project. You're going to devote your time to designing this. You're going to put your head down and, and, and start working on something. That's what I'm hearing because whatever it is that you're working on is going to bring in a lot of prosperity, success, and luck to you, all right? Okay, so... We have bat, take care, enemies are working against you. We have axe, forces working against you. Look at that. That's twice that came out. Hmm. We have grapes, time to go out and have fun. We have rooster, an arrogant, boastful person you should not cross. And we have tankard, celebration, fun, and enjoyment. All right, so I think this goes here. All right, whoever chose this pal, you guys, you're going to be getting the strength. For some reason, I'm hearing Leo with strength, okay? You are you are going to be getting the strength to go up against people who are working against you. Maybe you guys are also um, activists or you're, you're, you're going to start a, a, a movement or something, okay? You're going to start a movement, a group or, or something that, that, that is going to help the collective in some sort of way, all right? And there are going to be people who are wanting to cut this down or going to go against you or they won't agree with um yeah arrogant boastful people okay with rooster here there's some sort of there's there's some intense work that you will be Doing this, I'm, I'm hearing hyper focus for some reason. Okay, there's there's some sort of hyper focus. You're going to be hyper focused on something, and you're going to get a, a project finished. But once this project is finished, or once, well, not really finished, but what while you're working on this project, all right, or while you are manifesting this thing in, there's some there's some energies that are working against you. I'm hearing some of you might even be, um, some people might be throwing. Um, you might be going through spiritual attacks, okay? You might be feeling like you're going through spiritual attacks or you might be feeling like you have... Uh, I'm hearing the evil eye, okay? Um, there's someone who doesn't want to see you get ahead. With forces working against you, I I really don't like tuning into this, but I'm, I'm hearing like that you could be affected by magic binding magic i'm hearing someone has tried to throw binding magic at you enemies people there there are people working against you so with bat here For some reason, I'm hearing Scorpio or someone who has um, 
uh, was who was born in on in the year of the rooster in Ch the Chinese zodiac. Okay. I'm also hearing that you are going to be becoming you're going to be coming strong and you are going to be um for some reason um what's that it's like you're building up your ego to help protect you against these people okay you're going to be building up a healthy ego okay to pr help protect you against these people whoever it is that's working against you you're getting that strength that willpower to say no like piss off i've got work to do i'm, I'm doing something so you 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 might come off as arrogant and boastful to these people to these people who are working against you but you're being asked to be like that it's you it's you taking back your power okay you're going to be able to take back your power you're going to be able to revive yourself okay you're going to be able to revive or 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 unbind yourself from this energetic spiritual attack okay <clears throat> against you And once you're done with that, once you are coming into a time of celebration, fun, and enjoyment, and you're minky, you're going to be able to go out and have fun and let your hair down after this work is done, okay? So let's see. We have detached from drama. Yes, exactly. There are people around you who are trying to pull at your energy, who want let it go. Who want to see you angry who want to who want to pull at your anger i'm hearing okay work your magic beautiful yeah again i'm hearing magic work your magic someone is working magic against you trying to create drama in your life trying to trying to um i guess yeah bind you there's this this binding magic i'm hearing binding magic is binding binding your your strength or binding your willpower so that you don't get ahead or something like that okay you're being asked to detach from the dra drama i'm also hearing detach from social media detach from the people on social media let it go let it go anything that triggers you or uh, angers you or someone who is boastful someone who is trying to um uh trigger this anger out of you you're be being asked to let it go because you're being asked to all this anger you're being asked to transmute that anger and work your magic transmute it alchemize it into into the strength okay into persistence into revival into reviving yourself okay because you're coming into a, a huge time of luck prosperity and success here okay and they don't want to see you succeed they don't want to see you get ahead but use this anger Okay, don't use this anger to go up against these people. Use this 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 fuel, okay? Use that anger as the fuel to go after your manifestations here. Saint Saint Germain is also the ascended master that teaches a lot about manifestations, right? And look at that, the 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 what's that again? Metatron's cube, right? That's is it? It is, right? It's not. But it looks like it. <laughs> Wait, is that? Mm. The Merkaba. Okay, that's the Merkaba. Yeah. Maybe you want to work with the Merkaba. You want to work with uh, sac sacred geometry. Maybe you want to surround yourself in sa sacred geometry to, to um, protect yourself from this spiritual attack. You're trying to put out the fire. I can't put out this fire for God's sakes. Okay. 
All right. So, you are being asked to work your magic to protect yourself from whoever or whatever this is, whatever energy, energy this is. Okay? Tonight. We're going out tonight. Out and about tonight. Time to go out and have fun. Yeah. By Saturday, I'm hearing Saturday night is going to be significant. A Saturday night. Okay? You're going to be able to celebrate on a Saturday night. You're manifesting celebration, a time of success. You're going to be celebrating a success soon. Okay? But for you to focus on this, you're being asked to detach from the drama. Anyone who's bringing in drama to you, anyone who's trying to trigger your anger or um, being boastful and being arrogant with you, let it go, okay? It says here, with Kuan Yin here, let it go. I'm not gonna use this one. This deck. Five of Pentacles, that just popped out. Yeah, someone is trying to affect your finances, affect your abundance, all right? There is someone who is trying to affect your abundance. I know this is about manifestations and how your manifestations is coming in, but the reason why your manifestations is not coming in is because this person has put some, some sort of binding spell on you or binding magic or uh, throwing some sort of energetic uh, spiritual attack, okay? But you're just being asked to detach from the drama. Don't try and get back at this person, all right? Allow the universe to, to, to deal with it for you, okay? You're being asked to focus on working your magic, all right? Start surrounding yourself in sacred geometry. For some reason, I'm hearing, like, if you can get crystals with the Merkaba or even, like, black obsidian or, um, yeah, black obsidian in the shape of a Merkaba, if you can get that, or even a gold Merkaba, anything in the shape of a macabre and keep keep that around you like put that around the house that's what i'm hearing okay put put the macabre around your house or you can draw it out or you can look for images and just like put it around you and carry it around with you okay i'm gonna put that to the side because that wasn't supposed to come out anyways but it did come out so strength exactly you you're building your strength up again you're going to get your strength back all right you are going to get your strength back to go against to go it's not to go up against this person it's to go up against this energy all right you could be a leo you could be dealing with a leo you could have this in your chart all right nine of challenges yeah this person wanted to put you in some sort of uh worry state of worry state of anxiety state of depression this is where you're coming from you're asking and you're going to be able to let go of this energy all right this energy is going to be cleared in fact i'm going to put the intention in this reading right now that after you're done with this reading you are going to be cleared of this energy all right okay i want to make you happy yeah i want to make you happy you guys I want to make you feel alive. You're going to feel alive again. You're going to feel revived again, right? Seven of visions, all right? Yeah, this person has been trying to confuse you. Whoever this is, this, per this person has been trying to confuse you. It could be a queen of cups. It could be... I was sensing Scorpio with the bat there. I, I don't know why I didn't say so. But it could be a Scorpio... Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Okay, with the queen of cups here. Um... Or you could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio or you could be dealing with like these signs like you could be a water sign and another water sign is trying to send you some sort of uh, spiritual attack. Or take it where it res resonates, okay? I'm seeing Leo, I'm seeing um, nine of challenges air signs, uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius and I'm also seeing um, the cups, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, all right? yeah actually i'm hearing it could be a leo that's that, that that or a fire sign that's doing this to you okay 
because detached from drama is under strength here detached from this person here who is trying to overpower your energy okay but again take it where it resonates okay Some of you guys get so pissy when I when I get the signs all mixed up. This is a general reading, like I said, like take it where it resonates. If it doesn't resonate with you, then switch the signs up. Don't get your knickers in a twist just because you think that I'm reading like for you. And if you get triggered by that, then you need to go heal. Right? Don't come at me. <laughs> Okay, so, yeah, okay. I'm sensing you could be a water sign or you could have strong water in your chart. You are going to be getting your Ten of Cups with the Ten of Visions here. You're going to be getting your, 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 your wish fulfillment, your emotional fulfillment. Your emotional fulfillment is going to come again and that is going to push you into um, going after your magic or working on your magic there's something that you're supposed to be working on that somebody else doesn't want you to be working on you're building something you're creating something you are working on something you could be a musician you could be a designer you could be a content creator you could be a youtuber like me you could be a queen of cups someone very very intuitive you could be a high priestess okay i'm hearing a high priestess yourself you could be a tarot reader you could be you know someone who works in this energetic with all this with with energy okay you work with energy you work with magic all right yeah there's a lot of there's like spiritual warfare going on here all right but you you're going to be coming out of this all right you're going to be manifesting yourself out of this and you're going to be able to go ahead with your plans mm -hmm. Someone is jealous of you she's in fashion so you are you so, someone is envious of you but don't bother about that okay stop detach from the drama stop trying stop I'm hearing stop looking up tarot readings on who's jealous of you who is this because you're, you're you're inviting that energy into your auric field and the more you look up this person the more you are it's, it's almost like you're 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 creating this this energetic tie with whoever this is all right and it's making them easier for them to um for them to 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 attack you basically energetically attack you so stop watching those type of videos all right just for the time being until you can get out of this energy you can get out of this energy work your magic you can do this okay you can get out of this energy you can get out of this confusion all right whatever time of confusion you are able to let it go you're going to be able to let it go okay so don't worry all right i'm so sorry for any of you who are going through this okay i know how this feels but you can do it all right This is going to be axed out of your life, okay? Bats, you might be seeing bats around you. If you do see bats or if you do see... Um, um, yeah, Minky is saying yes. Where are you? What's wrong? Yeah, what's wrong? You wanna come up? You wanna come up? Come. You come up? Nice. Say hi. Want to say hi? Come up here. Say hi. No? Okay, no, no, no. Okay, okay. Bye. <laughs> Alright, so... Minky's butt. <clears throat> okay. So yeah, because Minky came up here, like it's almost like she's trying to protect me from that energy. Like she's like saying like, no. Okay, go away. Get Get away from my person <laughs> all right 
So yeah, surround yourself with your pets, all right? Allow your pets to just surround yourself with your If you have pets, like stay close to your pets. If you see bats anywhere, that means... Every time I see bats, she starts meowing. Bats? Bats. No? Okay. So if you see bats around, I'm not saying bats are evil creatures, okay? I love bats. Bats are cute, okay? They get a bad rep for some reason. But if you do see bats around, it's, it's a sign that, you know, that, that energy is still around you, okay? That energy is still around you. So maybe try and, um, yeah, do a rebuking... Um, uh, uh, a rebuking thingy. <laughs> I forgot the word. Well, let's just call it a rebuking spell, okay? Or a rebuking... Yeah, a rebuking spell. Any type of rebu rebuking spell, okay? You're going to be able to let this go, okay? Don't worry. If you feel like you're being under, you know binded somehow there's something about binding here someone doesn't want you to get ahead someone doesn't want you to to go after your dream someone doesn't want you to succeed though someone doesn't want to see you succeed someone wants to see you in the five of pentacles and this nine of swords energy they don't they're they're trying to pull your strength out of you okay by bringing you into drama okay don't give this person any more of your energy. When you get angry, at, when you are constantly angry at this situation, you are giving it your energy, okay? I don't care what anyone says. That, that through my own experience, that's what I've experienced. Like, the more I get angry, I'm, I'm wasting all of my energy on getting angry when I could be working on other shit, right? So detach from the bullshit, let it go. Okay, start surrounding yourself in, 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 in sacred geometry, start working with sacred geometry. Um, also look up law of assumption, all right? Work with your self-concepts, all right? Work your magic and leave this shit alone. All right? Okay, so... See if I can get some letters. We have a blank E A D E T F G and E. There's a lot of E's here. E E is like Ugh, you know, like constantly angry. Yeah, I, I can almost spell anger. Danger. I can almost spell danger. D E N G E R. There's no. Yeah. Dagger. Someone's trying to stab your back, you know, like stab you in the back. T. These could be initials, you guys, okay? Fade. It's going to fade off, alright? It will fade out. This will fade out. Yeah, if you have a dog, I'm hearing dog, okay? If you have a dog, keep that dog around you, okay? Sticks, um... Hang out with your dog. Feet. There's something about your feet. It's almost like your feet are heavy or your legs are heavy. You might feel heaviness in your feet and your legs. Okay? For some reason I'm hearing teeth. Okay, so there's something about teeth here. Or bones. Tea. Drink some tea. 
<laughs> um, I'm hearing don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Okay? Start saying that to yourself. I don't give a fuck. I-D-G-A-F. Okay? These could be... I'm hearing there's initials of the person here. Yes, and work with your with the fee. Work with the fee to 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 um, release this or or yeah. Some of you might be working with the fee fairies. Yeah, this person is daft. I'm hearing okay. Daft, or this person is trying to make you daft. Yeah, this person is trying to put you into the state where you feel daft. D could be a name. I mean Gita. That's an that's an Indian name, right? Or a Pakistani name, Gita. Um, feed. Don't feed into their stuff. Greta. I'm seeing Greta for some reason. Okay, the blank could be an R feed. Don't feed into into the drama. Don't detach from it, okay? Don't feed your energy into that anymore. I'm also hearing goat. So Capricorn could be significant here. Date. This is someone that you could have dated. What else can I get? This is going to be a feat, okay? But you are going to... You're going to um, get over this, okay? Trust, trust, all right? And you're going to be able to manifest your luck, prosperity, and abundance. I think I might have to change the title of this uh, video, but we'll see. G. Girlfriend. This could be a another girlfriend of yours. Could have been something you ate. They could have fed you something and you ate it. So maybe grapes. Okay? Yeah. Or wine. I mean, with tankard and grapes here, wine. Could have been something in the wine. I'm hearing sedate. Yeah, this tr this person is trying. Yeah, sedate. This person is trying to sedate your energy, feeding off your energy. Okay, I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna um, look into this anymore because I don't like the energy. All right, clear it, please. Okay, so my intention with whoever chose this pal, if you are going through under any spiritual attack, I manifest for you to get out of this energy so that you can put you know feed your anger into your projects feed your anger into putting into into you know releasing yourself from this bind all right okay all right so um i think that's all wait hold on I didn't pull this, I didn't turn this over for um, the last, uh, last pile, anyways, so, Taurus season, okay, this is going to end in Taurus season, I'm hearing, okay, from now until Taurus season, try and focus on working your magic, on surrounding yourself with the Merkaba, start manifesting, you, you are going to be able to work your magic, 
okay, against this person's magic, all right? But don't use your magic to go up against this person. Use your magic to manifest your luck, your prosperity, and your abundance, all right? Focus on that, okay? Create a structure, exactly. Yes, I was saying structure with pyrite here. Yeah, you're going to get more structured, all right? Right now you might, or, or right now you're just about to, you know, um, create some structure in your life. And you could also be a Taurus or you could be dealing with a Taurus, all right? This is all going to finish by Taurus season, okay? It's going to end by Taurus season. Or in two weeks, it says here two weeks, two months. Within two weeks or to two months, all right? So don't worry. Your luck, your prosperity, your abundance, your success is going to come in. You're going to be able to finish this project. You're going to be able to get your strength, all right? And then you're going to be able to celebrate, enjoy your, yourself, and it's going to be able, it's going to be able, it's going to be a time for you to go out and have some fun and eat some grapes, okay? Some good grapes, all right? <laughs> all right, so pal number three, that was your pal. Thank you so much for coming to my reading. I hope that reading, but if it did, um, yeah, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and also hit that notification bell uh, so that you guys get notified on future uploads. If you would like to book a personal reading for me, you can find my email details down below in the description box. Email me there and I'll send you the rates. Um, what else? Thank you so much for all your bookings, for all your donations, for all your comments, for all your likes. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, you guys. I truly, truly appreciate each and every single one of you. Um, keep those comments coming in. I truly love reading your comments. Um, your comments give me life, basically. I love it. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in my next video, okay? Love you guys. Take care and you can do this, all right? You're going to get your strength back. Don't worry, okay? Bye.